So we've seen that coordinate time and the coordinate time interval are frame dependent. The time between two space-time events, the exact same events, as measured in different frames will be different. So in the moving frame, the frame in which the clocks appear at rest, because they're moving as part of this frame, the event L and the event R are seen to be simultaneous. The interval between them is zero. In the at-rest frame, Anastasia's frame, the clocks are moving along with Beowulf, and so they're, they're not stationary, they're not straight lines. And in this frame, the time interval between these two events, the exact same events, the same physical occurrence, a light flash hitting a clock, is greater than zero. It's not simultaneous. So I want to mention quickly that there's another way of sort of thinking about the consequences of this, and that has to do with clock synchronization. So clock synchronization is also a frame-dependent idea. So here, um, we could use this experiment, Beowulf could use this experiment to synchronize clocks. So he's got um, his clock here, sends a light flash out one second later in space, one second later in time. So this should measure a time coordinate of, or a, a space-time coordinate of 1, 1. It should measure the speed of light to be the speed of light. So that would be a way for Beowulf to check that these two clocks were indeed synchronized with his watch here. So now, let's look at that from Anastasia's point of view. See, she observes these two events and sees that L occurs before R. If she was looking at Beowulf's clocks and observed that Beowulf's clocks said that these happened at the same time, Anastasia would say, Beowulf, your clocks are wrong. They're clearly not synchronized. Whereas Beowulf would say, no, you're crazy. My clocks are definitely synchronized. So what this is getting at is that clock synchronization is possible in one frame, but if clocks are synchronized in one frame, they're not necessarily synchronized in another frame. So again, clock synchronization is also frame dependent.